Um, all right, now to a missing persons report. Nine years later, nine St. Patrick's Days are now in the past, but still the elusive mystical beast that is the Crichton Leprechaun remains on the loose tonight. So have you seen him? Of course, this is just an amateur sketch. The real miniature gold monger remains in trees all over the port city. Sure. Local 15 News was yours and the world's news station to bring you the story of the day the little mushroom-faced creature surfaced for the first time and brought you reports from the brave residents giving aid to find the gold. This was our spells right here. This is a special leprechaun flute which has been passed down from thousands of years ago from my great-great-grandfather who was Irish. Of course, there are those non-believers. My theory is it's casting a shadow from the other limb. Could be a crackhead that got hold to the wrong stuff. And it told me to get up in a tree and play a leprechaun. On 2006, Local 15 reporter Brian Johnson learned from eyewitnesses the leprechaun only comes out at night and when you shine your light on it, well, the creature disappears. Of course, once the leprechaun is spotted, you always have to announce the victory with the correct chant. I got to do look up in the tree. Who else seen the leprechaun say yeah? yeah! You can watch the full YouTube video of our Crichton Leprechaun story on our local 15 Facebook page. Oh, and a final ploy to bring this little guy out today, our Facebook friend of the day, is the one and only Crichton Leprechaun. It's so easy to be our Facebook friend of the day. All you have to do is like our page and then click the Inside Local 15 tab to register.